If you follow Axiology on Instagram, I think as of a couple of days ago, you will have known that they've been working on some lip crayons. They actually sneak peeked a video of it um, back in January, I believe it was, because I think I emailed Erica like immediately. It was either January or like early February. And so I've been patiently waiting for them to be released since then, and they're finally going to be released today, the day that I post this video up. They will be all released. Um, they are six new matte lip crayons. Um, at least they say that they're matte. I haven't swatched them yet, so I don't know exactly the finish or what they look like. Um, I haven't swatched them. I haven't done anything with them. I haven't touched them. All I did was like open them and uh, look at the beautiful colors. Um, so you guys know that I've been a fan of Axiology lipsticks for quite a long time. I have, I think, 12 of their actual lipsticks. Um, Devotion, which I brought in here, and... Um, Vibration are two of like my absolute favorites. One is like a nice hot pink, the other one is a nice neutral. And I love their packaging, it's sort of like unique and it's got like the magnetic closure down here. And like the tubing is like metallic. So there is a little bit of a difference on the packaging with the, um, with the lip crayons. I think it's all plastic as far as I can tell. I'm pretty sure it is. And then I also wanted to sort of show you how much product is in, in the tube. So that is all of the product that's in the lip crayon tube. So it's definitely significantly less than a lip stick. Um, and so this isn't necessarily going to be a full review. I'm, I'm mostly doing a first impressions and demo. Since I've only had these for two days, <laughs> um, I just got them in the mail yesterday and this is the first time that I'm trying them. So I wanted to do sort of like a first impressions demo. And then later on down the line, sort of talk about performance wise. I can make a little bit of notes in the description bar before I post this because I'm gonna wear them today and um, sort of see how they wear. And I'll leave a little bit of a note and then I'll sort of keep you guys updated as I've worn them longer. But a little bit of information about lip crayons is they are going to be $26 each, which is a couple dollars less than the lipsticks go for. The formula of the lip crayons is mostly the same to the lipsticks um, aside for a couple of differences. There is shea and moringa oil in the lip crayons instead of grapeseed and coconut oil, which are in the lipsticks. But all of the other ingredients are the same. They still have that sort of signature sweet orange scent that the lipsticks have. And I'm just really, really excited about about these babies. I've been waiting for them for a long time. And I have tried, I think, one other lip crayon, the Juice Beauty lip crayons. I really liked that. Um, I've only got two colors of those, but I'm really excited to see Axiology sort of dip into the, the lip crayon realm. So I'm gonna start this swatches. I'm actually gonna do these alphabetically because I'm feeling a little a little alphabetical today. So there are six different colors. There is Bliss, Enchant, Intrigue, Keen, Serene, and Valor. So here is Bliss. And I definitely feel like they're mostly matte. I don't know that I would call them like super matte. They're definitely, they, you can see they do, do have a little bit of a sheen, but they're pretty, they're not sparkly or glittery or they're definitely more matte than the lipsticks are. Um, and I like the formula of these. They're really smooth. And I appreciate the crayon because it's like easy to apply and sort of like get the like the outside edges of your lips without like going over like sometimes you do with like a lipstick. So I really, really appreciate the, uh, the crayon actually. So this is Bliss. Just a nice peachy orangey color. Perfect for spring. So here is Enchant. Just a really beautiful deep purple color, sort of more like eggplant. This one will be perfect uh, when fall rolls back around, but actually, I mean, I mean, I really like it. I've tried a couple of colors like this recently and I've really liked sort of like the look of the, the really dark purple lipstick. So this is a really, really nice option for that color. And again, I do feel like they're mostly matte. They don't, they definitely don't have though, although they don't have sort of like a, like very flat finish, which I, I do prefer sort of like this, this like mostly matte look and not like flat matte. So this one is Intrigue. It's like a very intriguing brown sort of like nude color. Again, I do really sort of like this like dark kind of look. 
And I feel like this one is more, it's flatter than the other two. So this one is more matte than the other ones. If you can see, there's like less of a sheen. But I actually really, really like this. And I know a lot of people, like the brown is in, so it's, I think this is a beautiful brown option. Like I don't like brown on myself and I really, really like this one. This one is Keen, beautiful orange color. If you like Virtue, the orange color that, the orange lipstick that Axiology offers, you will love this one. Even Worth, I think. it's. I think it's very similar to Worth um, or Virtue. Like either one of those two, the color is very similar and uh, very beautiful. I like this one. This one would get in a lot of wear, that's for sure. So this one is serene, and I thought looking at it, it was going to be like sort of a purple, but I feel like it's more of one of those like grayish shades, like one of those, you know, like gray, beige, nude shades. Um, I actually really, really like this color. I'm surprised because I thought this was going to be like the one color I was like not going to like, but I really like this. I think it's a great nude color. It's not like too gray. It's not too nude. It's just, it's really pretty. Um, I'm sort of in love with this color. So if you really like those like gray, grayish shades, I think you'll definitely love Serene. Okay, the last one we have here is Valor, or Valor. Valor, I don't know how to pronounce, V-A-L-O-R. <laughs> um, and Color Me Impressed, I believe all of these are super beautiful shades. I've loved every single one. Oh, I'm just so obsessed with these. <laughs> this one's a really nice, like, deep, like, red-orange-brown color. It's sort of like a nice mix of the three colors, and it's not... It's flattering, and it's beautiful, and it's deep, and it's... I am obsessed with these. I feel like... I do feel like some of these... Like, the last four were, like, really matte, whereas, like, the first two had sort of a more sheen, but these, this one definitely doesn't. If you can see, there's, like, hardly any sheen here. So I really love the formula of these. I think they're a great matte option for if you're looking for matte, like, lipsticks, lip colors, whatever. And these are really easy to apply because of the sort of crayon shape. I'm really appreciative of that. Um, I just, I love the formula. They're non-drying, like, because I know some matte formulas can be really drying because of the formula to make them that. Um, but maybe it's the Shea and the Moringa in, in, uh, in place of the grapeseed and the coconut that makes these more of like a matte. Or maybe it's like the Mica. I'm not sure what makes these more matte and more comfortable than a lot of other lipsticks. But um, I think these are really great. This is a great sort of like beginning range. Um, I love these. These are just fantastic. So one more time, this is Valor. Valor. <laughs> so like I was saying, I think that these are all fantastic colors. Um, I didn't think that there was one in here that I didn't really like. I really like them all. I think they're all extremely flattering colors. I think Erica did a fantastic job. Um, these are, they're all beautiful. I can't get over, I can't get over the formula. I can't get over the colors. I can't get over how easily they apply. I just think these are going to be fantastic and I cannot wait until she creates more of these colors because I think this is a superb formula to the lipsticks. I mean, her lipsticks are beautiful and I really love the colors in those, but, um, I think I prefer the lip crayons, honestly, because the formula is just really beautiful. The colors are all really flattering. Um, the only thing you're missing is a very hot pink in the in the crayon. So you get me one of those and I'm going to be a very happy girl. <laughs> um, so I hope that these lip swatches were helpful. I hope that you check these out. As far as I know, I don't know at least right away that they're going to be available anywhere but the Axiology um, website, so I'm gonna leave that down below and if I find them on other sort of like stores I'll update that and link those down below as well, but I really love these um, I hope you get your hands on some if you are looking for lip crayons if you're looking for matte lipsticks If you're looking for just something with really easy really beautiful colors um, I just think I can't I just can't get over these. I think they're fantastic. So I hope you enjoyed this video I hope it was helpful and uh, let me know what your favorite color was because I don't know that I can pick a favorite I think I don't know, I really liked Serene, and um, Intrigue was really pretty, Enchanted, you know, I don't know that I could pick a favorite. Maybe Serene. Maybe Serene is my favorite, but I think this is a close second, because 
just beautiful colors again and I don't you know I don't care about colors for seasons so it's not like I'm these are like oh these aren't really spring colors like I don't care I'll wear whatever I think looks good so um <laughs> I hope this was helpful to you guys and I will see you guys in my next one bye